We are in Chinatown on Main at Pender for our latest edition of Fong on Food. And Nathan has brought me here today for one of my favorite foods ever. Thank you, Nathan. Vietnamese. Well, we're at it. Golden Garden. Mm -hmm. Kim Saigon Sandwich was a little hole in the wall for 18 years on East Hastings. And her, Kim and her brother Melvin opened this restaurant last year. Great comfort food, great Vietnamese pho. It's the stuff I like. All right, let's get inside okay. there and dig in. Okay. Well, so uh, we're inside Golden Garden, and you know what? This is some of my comfort food. Oh, yes. You know, and Vietnamese cuisine is not heavy. They use a lot of fresh herbs, mm -hmm. fresh ingredients, fresh produce. So it's really healthy too, right? It is really healthy, uh, except for maybe something like this. This is called ban jiao, and it's a crepe stuffed with bean sprouts, with shrimp. And you actually take a bit, you wrap it in lettuce. Right. So it's yeah. like a Vietnamese taco. Oh, yeah. okay. I didn't know that. You know what? I've had this before. I probably ate it incorrectly. And then you have not chan, dip the here? dipping sauce. Okay. Everyone pretty well knows about the salad roast. Mm -hmm. This has pork and shrimp, and it has a nice peanut sauce. Of course, yeah. And you have the spring rolls, mm -hmm. which is wrapped with rice paper. Okay, so a little bit different from Chinese spring rolls. That's right. Yeah. It's a lot lighter. Yeah. And traditionally, you eat it with the uh, fresh tomatoes or cucumber, and you wrap it in lettuce, and you have some mint with it, or oh. basil as well. Again, something I didn't know. Yeah, okay. you just don't eat like a Chinese spring roll. Okay. You actually wrap it with lettuce okay. and you eat it, you know. And that makes it fresher too, That's right. right. Yeah, okay. And this is probably my comfort my food. Favorite. Uh, Vietnamese pho. Yes. It's not, it's pre everyone always thinks it's pho. I still say pho unless I'm in Vietnam and then I say pho. But. Well, pho, it's from the French derivative of pot au feu, mm -hmm. cooked in one pot or one bowl. Right. And you traditionally get it with, you know, some chili, some lime, some bean sprouts, mm -hmm. some Thai basil. And you have all these condiments like hoisin sauce, chili. Yeah. So you can... Pick you, out your own flavor. So you can do you it want. the way you want, right? Now, I, I, how I usually do it, I, I break the basil a bit and put it in. I put, put the bean sprouts, bean sprouts in. in. Yeah. If there's a pepper, I put that in, and then I dip the meat into a, a combination of the. Chili yeah, you sauce can do that in. as well. And traditionally, this one has rare beef, but yes. you know sometimes you can get tripe and beef tendon or well done beef like brisket or fatty flank, which is my favorite. Fatty flank, you know, <laughs> and it's cut nice and thin. I like lots of onions with mine. Yes. But the important thing about pho is the broth. Yes. The broth, it's very ar aromatic. Yeah. It has a lot of star anise and cinnamon and yeah, cardamom. So it's it's uh it's something they've got a slave over over a hot stove for a long time it sits there is that right well here um at golden garden they they do about 80 liters a day that's incredible that's a lot of broth and it takes about 12 hours to simmer you want to extract all the nutrients and the flavors from the beef bones and mm. you know so the broth is really important mm -hmm. and obviously there's rice noodles on the bottom so mm. this is my comfort food to me oh it's so good and and you're right it's all in the broth and it's such a nice velvety flavorful uh, The other thing we didn't talk goodness. about is the bami mm -hmm. or the Vietnamese subs. Also, you know, yeah. it's it's uh, derived from the French. The French brought the baguettes. Right. And know. there was a lot of obviously the French influence in, in Vietnam. That's Vietnam. right. So this um, here there's roasted chicken, but what makes it Vietnamese? There's pickled carrots and daikon. This has jalapeno, mm -hmm. cilantro. So it's got a bite. Yeah, and the sandwich, the f texture of the bread is really important too. Oh, all of my favorite foods here. Oh, and one more thing, the uh, the coffee. Oh, Vietnamese coffee. There's It's very strong coffee, and there's uh, condensed milk on the yeah. bottom. And I like it with ice, you know, and then you froth it up in here, and Starbucks, you know, whatever. <laughs> you can't beat this. You can't beat a, a real Vietnamese coffee. Golden Garden. Golden Garden, Maine and Pender. All right, thank you so much. You're welcome. Bon appetit, everyone.